just an illusion. Just an illusion. To prevent fatal injuries in football, I have invented this new type football helmet, which I believe will do much to rid the game of fatalities. <laughs> Dark side, light this bitch up. Monster on the beat, ho, depot, any rap, nigga, he a free throw, man down, call like Amber Lambs, tell him, yeah, free throw, let a nigga to the cross, he walk around like Tizo, Yo, what's up with these jabroni ass niggas trying to see Compton, the shit industry jumping, hate bro. from Marlon D. Mama, how many options you really got, I mean it's too many options, I'm finna pass on this body, I'm John Stockton, <laughs> beat your ass and hide the Bible if God watching, sometimes you gotta pop out and show what it do, man? Awesome. What it do? Oh, whoa, whoa, I ain't gonna go there with it. What's happening? What's happening? Oh my gosh, we kicked it off live. <laughs> Salute to you, man. Salute to you. What you sipping on over there, I, man? I got, I, got the, uh, I got the tequila, man, a little um, Matthew McConaughey joint. Come on. Ooh, that that's a, peach, man. That's a good that, that ain't that ain't a bad look. I'm gonna have to grab me a bottle yeah. tomorrow. What up? What up, chat man? What's that? Drex? What's bitch, good? Man. Man. I've been on. Yes, sir. We, we got a nice little turnout today. I mean, I obviously yeah. we know why. You know, yeah. we uh, we spinning this wheel tonight. Um, the first thing we're gonna do is I'm, I got I already got every all the names that did sign up. I got them on the list. We're gonna do the uh we're going to do the um, randomizer and you guys know how the how the wheel works that will be i think it's 11 uh total cuz you got people that want to do twice it'll be 11 spins and wherever you wherever you end up and like say you say you're number 1 
on the randomizer, that first spin will be what you get um, uh, on the randomizer or whatever. On the, uh, you, you own what you own what number one is on this on on the, on the wheel. So uh, you know we're going. I got it. Yeah, we're gonna get right into it. It's, it's, it's a lot of people do, man. Let me see if I can bring it up here. Got random.org up here. Let's go ahead and switch over to it. Boom. All right, so what we'll do, let me just double check, make sure nobody else signed up um, right before. I did check right before I started, but. Oh, no, one more person did jump on there. Let's see. View reactions. It was uh, my man Diesel. Look at the new guys, man. Wanted to try this thing out. Let's put him on the list here. Did I spell that right? Man, I caught. <laughs> so let's go ahead and get right into it. Hey, it is what it is, man. I I I, I joined, so I said, let's see what happens. You know what I mean? So we're gonna go ahead and randomize hey, it. One or two. I did one. I'm not crazy. Are ah, you scared? One, <laughs> two, three, and that's the list here. So okay, as you I see it. here, I got five. Five and six. That's crazy. <laughs> back to back. So you got that back to back crazy. spins. All right. So we 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 gonna, we gonna, we gonna jump right into the spins. Oh, what's going on here? I need you to load up, buddy. There it is. Go ahead and make it full screen here. You like you like the little decorated uh. Yeah. You know what I mean. So here is spin number one. Do I got sound with this? Let me see. Make sure, make sure. Yeah, yeah OXI is number one. Do I got sound with it? I hope, hopefully, we got the sound with it. Whatever. We don't, we don't. So, here's the first spin. There it is. We got a little sound. Spin number one. Oxy. Minus one. Minus one. <laughs> That's crazy. So, you can pick the player that you want for this. Hey, I got that shit early when I was doing the the, uh, the practice joint. That was one of the ones I got. Yeah, I mean those those have the highest odds, so you you will probably see a lot of that. Um, those have the highest odds on the board. So, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, who is number two? Because bad coaching make rears his ugly head again. Hey, see, so you got the, uh, you got what, what, what the, uh, what the, what the, what, what the results are like, like what, like what bad coaching is. If, if you can, you know, wow, wow. Uh, shit. Let them know. I think that's the punt every third down. In the first game. Well, it wouldn't be the first game because we're in this, we're in week two. But yeah, so bad coaching is. Must punt every third down. Of your of your next games, so whoever whoever is number two on the list, I'm I'm not, I'm not switching back yet. But whoever is number two on the list, you oh, are. Up, all right, shit at. Right. Commands and it's under commands, so if you can have that, okay. you can have it up. For me. And here is spin number three. Dun, 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 dun. Uh oh, you get nothing. Spin number three. You don't clap for that, but hey, it is what it is. Spin number four. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Spin number four. One speed loss. Ooh, to your fastest wide receiver. Yes, That's sir. That's crazy. So, yeah, <laughs> AC with the breakdown. Whoever is, whoever is number four, so we, 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 we since we don't know, we not even going to flip back and forth. We just going. We just going. We just going to go down. We going to go. And this yeah. is you right here. You five and six, yeah, right? Five it's and six. Come on. Back to oh. back spins. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Just short of an extra X factor. Well, that's crazy. You know, I'm gonna slow down a little bit because I'm, I'm probably ahead of everybody. So. Mine is one. You get to pick the player. You get to, it has to it has to be a position player, but you get to pick the player. So, your second one. I'll wait to I'll wait to it. <laughs> no, that's 
Bullshit. Oh my That's god. <laughs> I had a free scoop with Star. Bro, oh, that's crazy. my God. Oh, that was brutal. Here, Man, let me see if I want to put this, this is spin, num point. spin number seven. Here we go. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. 25,000 points to whoever is number seven. Wow. 25K in points. See, the, see, the wheel does pay off. Man, fuck that wheel, man. <laughs> Spin number eight. Here we go. Blank. Arthur Blank. So let me see where we at. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This is spin number nine here. This is Drex, he says. Big spoins. Ew. Whatever that mean. I ain't, I'm pissed because I, I missed out on that free superstar. Blank. Arthur. And this is number number 10 here. We got two more spins left. Here's number 10. No, we got two more because we got we got 12 now. Yeah, man, this wheel spin ass. Number 10 is a blank as well. Shooting blanks. Here's 11. Whew. Plus one, not minus one for a change. Right. And then the final spin. Another plus one. All right, so let's flip on back the page here. Garbage. And let's see. So, Oxy, your first spin is minus one. Uh, Roger, that's Roger. <laughs> His next game, Roger will have to punt every third down. Drex, you didn't get anything on your first spin. Commanders, Ben. You have one speed loss uh, to your fastest wide receiver. We'll take care of that, so you don't have to worry about that. For you. <laughs> Shine, minus one, then a blank, uh, and then Diesel, number seven, with a 25K payout. The late entry. That would have been my spot. The late entry with a 25K payout. Man, I missed out on a free superstar upgrade. I didn't get anything. Drex didn't get anything. OXI didn't get anything on his last spin. Trending now, and Roger got plus one. All right, so we have that down pat. I already posted my guy. All right, so let's go ahead and get to the show, man. It's good to be here. We are, uh, that was fun. You know what I mean? Spin, spin, ain't, spin didn't really break nobody crazy. We always had some big, big hits. I mean, the 25K, that's the first time that's hit. That, that. One speed to your fastest guy. That hurt. That hurt. That hurt. Especially, especially if he, if he, if he, you know, ninety nine. Well, I guess it won't matter if he ninety nine going to ninety eight. Your fastest guy like a ninety three or something. Yeah, I, I, we'll see. We'll see. It, it, it wasn't ugly, undisputed. It wasn't ugly. Oh, we got the wrong. We got the wrong thing up on the screen. Here we don't. We talking and don't got. So let's clap it up for the for the the wheel of odds there. Uh, Drex was supposed to be doing this. Hopefully, he'll, he'll, he'll pop in soon. We'll see. But we're going to jump right, right into the NFL. You know how we do. Um, with our NFL Minute, I'll let you kick it off. Since I always kick off kick off the NFL topic every week. Uh, go ahead. See what you got. All right. So... Oh, yeah. Hold on. Actually, I guess I should introduce it, right? Because it, it is a joint yeah, topic. Yeah, yeah, you can introduce yeah. it. Um, so this NFL Minute, we're going to, we, 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 we are going to uh, pick our sleeper team um, post-draft. The draft happened, you know. We talked about it a little, a little bit about it last week. But a team that we think is going to – that didn't make the playoffs last year, 
that's going to make the playoffs this year. They may not make a run, but they'll just make the playoffs. So who was your team that you had, had for that? Ah oh, man, I actually had two, but I'm I, I've been on the fence with two, but I'm a I'm a I'm a I'm a I'm a, I'm a go out on the limb. Okay. And I'm gonna say the Titans. Mm. I, I like what they did, not necessarily during the draft, but like free agency and like getting like getting those wide receivers got, and weapons. Yeah, yeah. They got Tyler Boyd, et cetera. You know what I'm saying? And I mean, they already already had a, a, a decent defense, like I mean, and. That division is it's up is, for grabs for sure. Yeah, it's up for grabs. Like outside of the Houston, uh, Jags, not Colts, Jags. I, I, I'm not really. Anthony's I coming know. off that injury. You don't know if yeah, Houston so. can do it back to back year. You're not worried about Levis over there. I feel like with the weapons that he has and the line, he got a nice old line. Has, got a nice yeah, old line. And the line that he has, like. You just gotta manage the game. Just not lose the game. Like you know, gotta get perform the ball, at that point. Get the get throw it to the playmakers. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I feel like that's my sleeper team. My other one was the Chargers. Mm. And I only say that because of Harbaugh. Like I, I feel like he's an elite coach. Like, like he's he, finally gonna get that that roster been talented as hell forever. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. They like and, the they like the Chargers of the of the, of the West. I mean, like the Cowboys of the West. Yeah. So those were those were the, uh, the those were the two I was thinking about. Uh, so my team that I have as my my sleeper pick that I think is going to make the playoffs, and I know I talk trash all off season. You don't understand why I said I talk trash all off season. I think the Bears will make the playoffs this year, and reason being is I think that division. Is up for grabs. Green Bay was good, and Jordan Love was amazing, but they did get worse, you know. So, but they bringing in Josh Jacobs helps helps a lot. Um, I think if Caleb is what they say he's going to be, you know, you know me, I was a Fields guy. If Caleb is what they say he's going to be, with all that he has around him, I think they can make the playoffs with that team. Um, and. It's it's, it's, it's it's like I said, the division is up for grabs. Your, your, your boys, I think you guys are still a year away. Huh. So, like I think I think you guys will have another you know top ten pick coming up this this year, just with a, like a developmental year for your guy. You know what we what we're looking for. I guess what you guys are looking for is showing some showing some signs of you know improvement. He's, he's not going to start from the jump. Right. So whenever he whenever he takes over. You know, that's that that I think I think I think that's what you the, the the results you want to see once they take over. And since you picked two teams as well, I'm gonna pick another team. And he's in the chat talk, talking right now. I got the Raiders with that defense making the playoffs as a seven seed. In that division? In that division. I, I, I okay, so I I feel like the Raiders have a better chance than the Bears. The Bears are gonna finish last in the division. Mm. They're gonna finish last in the division. We'll I, make, what makes you say that? Like, is it just is is, is it just the defensive side of the ball that didn't show any improvement? Like, no, I thought their, de- their defense like was middle a, of the I pack. Like they got a, they got a good defense. I just feel like the offense, like they they're bringing in the rookie quarterback, right, right, in that division. But you still have the same head coach. Mm. I, I mean, you know what I'm saying? You still have he uh, is Dookie. What's Eberflus? Eberflus. Eberflus. But you still have the same head coach. Like, you know what I'm saying? Granted, you upgraded the roster. You the roster's some, nice. Like on paper. You upgraded the roster. On paper, you upgraded the roster, put some weapons around Caleb, but you still didn't address the off- offensive line, which ha- was terrible. Like the offensive line has was terrible with Fields. Right. Um now Fields held on to the game. ball. Fields, one, one, you know, I'm a big Fields guy, but he did held hold on to the ball a little yeah. bit. Yeah. Oh yeah, definitely, uh, definitely. So but um yeah, I think. Oh, 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 a little sideboard here is this guy out of the blue. Where do you where do you put DJ Moore in the in in in, in the pantheon of wide receivers in wide the receivers? league? Yeah. Uh probably top fifteen, top twenty, top fifteen probably. I don't have him top ten. I got him top five, bro. You know DJ top Moore's my guy. <laughs> DJ Moore. Top so 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 so, so 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 let's run it down. Jet is obviously number one. Jet is. You Tyreek can go. Hill. You can go. Tyreek Chase, Ceedee Lamb. 
Okay. You got AJ Brown. You got uh you got uh I ain't gonna say Mike Evans, but you got I mean Puka. I, I mean he, Puka. I, I, you can't put you, Puka over him. You, I mean I would put I would put a cup over over uh Puka. But I mean you can't not say Mike Evans. Yeah, Mike, 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 Mike Evans done it with all different type of wide receivers. Yeah, got. I, mean, I don't know, man. Oh, undisputed, undisputed. Devonte Adams, undisputed. Tay is Tay. I forgot about. So I, 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 so I might, I might have to go top fit. But I like DJ Moore, man. He, he's done it with. He's done it with a lot of bad quarterbacks. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I, so, I, I'm, I'm um, going top fifteen. I like top fifteen too. I, I take that back. Who, who y'all think not making the playoffs this year that made it last year? Ooh. That's a good one. Uh, who made the playoffs last year? I'm going to say Pittsburgh. Mm. I'm going to say Pittsburgh. The only reason why I say that is because I believe the Bengals are going to be better with Joe Burrow back in. Right, right. Ford not going to make it out that division. But I, I got Baltimore and Cleveland making it out. In okay. that division. Ford not going to make it. So I feel like Pittsburgh gonna be the odds go out out undisputed ask the question but unfortunately undisputed i think it's tampa that's not gonna make the playoffs <laughs> i think it's tampa that's not gonna make the play i think the nfc i think the nfc is gonna be a lot better this, so you this, think this the year Falcons gonna win that division with kirk listen that vi- division that division is is probably the worst division it's in, up in for the grabs league. it's up I for grabs and I like the Falcons offseason. But, again, that's because they got my guy. So, I'm a little biased right now. But I do like what the Falcons have done this offseason. Um, and Dan Quinn's a former Cowboy guy. So, we'll see what he can do. I think, I, I think he was a little overrated. He had a lot of talent to work with. But he made it happen with that talent. Um, but, yeah, I think it's Tampa that might not make the playoffs. But it all depends on which Baker you get. So... You go, man. Baker. I, I don't know. I, I feel like Baker played good division, last year, man. I, yeah, I, I feel like that division is just so trash that it, anybody can win that division. Is that the, the is, Panthers? The Panthers could win that division. Is, no, Pan, Pan, Panthers top three pick this year. <laughs> um, is is that a is that the worst division in the NFL? Yes, by far. Then it, so both both of the South divisions are, are probably the two worst divisions in the league. AFC yeah, and NFC South. So. Yeah, those are the two. Those are the two worst divisions in the league. That, that was fun. I mean, NFL NFL talk. NFL talk. So we're going we're going to shift gears here uh, over to the NBA. And my NBA minute is again. It's 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 also. I guess I guess it's a question. Is this a joint? Is you, we gonna do this as joint, or did you have something that you wanted to talk about NBA wise? I know the playoffs is going on, or whatever the case may be. No, 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 no. So we, we so, so we we gonna we gonna do a joint one here. So, yeah. is the NBA padding Jokic's career accomplishments to 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 put him up as the the guy? You know what I'm saying? Because you got you got to think about it though. Like when when we talk about greatest basketball players of all time. You bring up Jordan. You bring up Wilt. You bring up Bill. You bring up LeBron. Kobe. Man, I was waiting on you to say. I don't know why you waited so long to say it. Come <laughs> on, man. You, you, wanted, you didn't want to say the man name, man. And you know, before I, before I, before anybody calls me a hater, he 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 shouldn't have won his first MVP. I thought that one should have went to Joel. The the last years should have went to him. Like it should have been reversed. Like I thought, like the 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 way they did it this time around. But then this year. For Gildress to take his team to the playoffs the way he did, he deserved to be honored for that for that award. I know that's not a hot take. I mean, even Jalen Brunson could have been MVP, taking it like the Knicks ain't been relevant in forever. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. This, this dude put the team on his back. You know what I'm saying? If and I, I think if Ant didn't get hurt, he would be he he would be a contender for for MVP. But I feel like Jokic was just like a like here, just take this, man. I feel, I feel like uh, because Murray was hurt for so many games, and they still finished with second, but they finished with the same record as the Thunder, right? 
I believe that's why he won MVP. Now, granted, Gil just should have won it just because the Thunder are so a young team. But, man, they're a well-balanced team. Like, they, like, they're a good team. Like, yeah. those guys. Okay, she's a lot enough, better than. Yeah, they don't yeah. get enough credit for for what they do. But you had a lot as of people. As, yeah, not to cut you. You had a lot of people saying, like, the Lakers and the Warriors want to be at that seven and eight to get the Timberwolves and the and 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 OKC. Yeah. I think they get them out of there too, because <laughs> they yeah. they would be. Yeah. But go ahead. Uh, I feel like Jokic just to be a big and do what he does. Like <sighs> having the average a triple double. Like you know what I'm saying. And if you look at advanced analytics, I don't know if many of y'all look at that. Like he's like well above everybody. Like as far as advanced analytics and what he does to impact the game on women and stuff like that. So I get why they, why he won, but I felt like Gil just should have won just because of the impact he made with OKC being a non-playoff team. And they was the, they the one seed in the, um, in the West. Um, but as far as like his first MVP, he definitely should have won that man. Murray missed damn near all the whole season. Yeah, Murray was out the whole and, year. Yeah. yeah Old season, they was the number one overall seed in the playoffs. So I get why why he won us. And so now that was that was his okay. second MVP. They they was number one overall. His well, first, yeah, yeah. yeah. First one, they, they was a playoff team. I think yeah, it was, like, was a play. They was like six or seven for something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah Actually, five or six uh, or something like that. But yeah, but my, reason why I say that is because that first one that he won, Joel was clearly the best player in the league at that point. So again, they gave it to him, obviously. But again, because you because you talk about advanced analytics, it's stuff that they like. If you're not looking that information up, you don't you don't see that during the game. The guy impacts a lot of different stuff during the game, and if you look at the advanced analytics, the dude's the greatest greatest player of all time, based off the numbers. You know what I'm saying? It's wild. The dude is doing what what he's out there doing. Um, but I don't know. That that came to mind. Cause I'm just like, damn. You know what I'm saying? Like, yo. Y'all giving away these MVPs to this guy when you could have gave LeBron an MVP every year during that 11-year finals run that he was going on. Here we go. I mean, am I lying to him? Yes, you are. All right. <laughs> All right. But one, and the reason why I'm going to say that is because if you think about it, he had stacked teams. He had stacked teams now. Stacked teams. <laughs> Like, come on, man. I mean, it's easy. Okay, so when he was with Cleveland, okay, when he was in Cleveland, he won MVP. Hey, he definitely deserved. Like, Absolutely. You know he, was, yeah, but... hey, he was, you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna say he was carrying some non-all-stars, non-superstar players to the finals, you know what I'm saying, to the playoffs and like that. But once he got in, in Miami and went back to Cleveland and had Love and Kyrie, come on, man. You like, take, that waters, you, that waters you take, down. You take LeBron off that Heat team, they're a fifth seed. They're still a playoff team, though. It's a and, 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 and wait, 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 and, and and Wade had an already proved proven prior to that he prior can win. To, prior to when he had when he had healthy knees. I'm Wade, just Wade recruited LeBron to extend his career. No, nah, they were, they had an already, but he didn't recruit. They had an already talked about joining. Right, but I'm saying like, that that conversation comes up because a, I can't do this by myself no more. I carried this team and, and broke my body. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. So then, you go back to the Cavs. You got Love. You got Kyrie, and you take LeBron off that team. It had, like the year before LeBron wasn't on that team. They picked first overall. Love wasn't on that team either. Yeah, Love was on there. A lot of people were not on that team. It, it, you know what I'm saying? They changed the whole team outside of yeah, Kyrie because LeBron Nobody brought all, LeBron brought them. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But but let's get off of LeBron for a second. Let's talk. Let's talk Please. Shaq. When 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 they gave, uh, um, what's his name, the the guard, uh, Steve Nash, his MVP trophies. Oh yeah, I, 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 that's what I'm saying. I, I definitely come on. <laughs> they, like, do back, they, they do that a lot. They do that a lot. Back then, they were giving MVPs to the the best player on the best team as far as like overall records, and yeah. that's what Shaq Shaq brought that up. Like you know, what I'm saying that that's I mean not Shaq, but uh, Chuck brought that up. Like, of course we everybody know. Shaq was the most valuable player in the league. Like, you know what I mean? The best player in the league. But they didn't have the best record. The Suns did. Mm-hmm. And it was because of Steve Nash. Like, I don't 
I don't believe Steve Nash should have won those MVPs over him and Kobe. Like, you know what I mean? Dro, I wasn't trying to say it, but you said it for me, bro. So, yeah. That, 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 that's what I was getting at, man. It just, it, it's, it's a little weird. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, and, and undisputed with a great, with a great uh, comment there. The numbers are consistent with LeBron no matter who around him. Look at this year, 40 years old. You know what I'm saying? It was something that came up in the chat. Yeah, that's cool. The numbers are consistent because we know he's stat pads. We know he's going to do that regardless. Stat pads. Yes. Yo, man, if that's the on. case, Yoga stat pads. Come on, man. Come on, man. We know LeBron going to do that. Like, regardless, if they could be down 40. That nigga going to keep trying to score. Absolutely. Absolutely. Why not get my buckets? I'm the only See, one that exactly. can score. I'm the only one that can score. Nah, bro. I'm sorry. Nah. Nah. What well, I'm going to keep passing it out here to Reese for and, and, and he building a house over here. A brick and house. A year, and a year that, uh, what year was it? The one that Kyrie got hurt. Goddamn. LeBron ain't passed nobody. <laughs> and and what was the, the center name? He was actually eating. Um, oh, um, I forgot um, his name. Boy, the boy that uh, did, did the show, the uh, Kardashian. He went dirty. to the Lakers. He ended up going to the Lakers. I can't think of his name right now. I don't know who you're talking about, Dan. McGee? No, 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 no. Uh, hold on. Stay back. Or, I, mean, that's what, I thought it was Tristan. I thought it was Tristan Thomas. But he said, nah. No. No, 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 no. Ogowskis? No, man. Oh. But anyway, uh, it, it, you talked about Shaq being the most dominant player. They brought up Moss and where, 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 where we had ranked them out. This is, this is off the, this is off the uh, topic. But they had, I, I was saying that, he, uh, no, actually said, Who's better, T.O. or Moss? Mosgolf. Oh, Timothy Mosgolf. Yes. Yo, wasn't he picked before? Who was, who was Timothy he Mosgolf? He was averaging a double-double that series, too. Timothy Mosgolf. I can't believe yeah. he brought up Timothy Mosgolf. Um, Same, man. But, yeah, uh, they brought up T.O. versus Randy, and he was trying to say, you know, oh, I got T.O. over Randy. That's controversial. And I'm like, not really, though. I don't think I don't think that's controversial. Like, many people not, got T.O. Over Randy career achievement wise, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Um, Tio don't have no Super Bowl either. Yeah, neither one of them have Super Bowl nah. rings. So I'm still going Randy. I'm still going Randy, but hey, impact I, I, wise, I impact wise. But I, if somebody was to say To, like if you look at the numbers, <laughs> bro, To, like like Drake said, To was a dog. Like, Absolutely, he was one of those. He was he was the wide receiver. You know, I talk about I talk about those. those, those I'm a I, 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 wide receiver is probably one of my favorite positions, um, along with like defensive backs, uh, yeah. you know, things like that. Obviously, because that's what we played as kids and stuff like that. So, um, like when 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 I, when I think of the I think of the wide receivers that I like that that my game was similar to. We talk about like the Larry Fitzgeralds, the Isaac Bruce. Like the guys that will go over the middle and ain't scared to get hit. I'm not talking about I'm at the level of a Larry Fitz. I'm talking about I, I'm not running away from guys. You know what I'm saying? I'm running to the action. You know what I'm saying? And T.O. was one of those kind of guys. Like T.O. is, you know, I mean? he wasn't really known for his route running, but yeah, but yeah, he was he quick twitch. That. He was what two twenty two thirty. T.O. was a fucking machine. A monster. Like, he was a monster. Like, Randy was a lanky, skinny. Fast motherfucker that just jump over everybody like so I I wouldn't want to go do no post and get smacked by Sean Taylor either you know what I'm saying like shit yeah I mean but that those those, those Anquan Bowdens of the world those are the type of wide receivers you ain't yeah, there's Brian you ain't gonna you, you, receivers. yeah you ain't, yeah you ain't gonna expect a ton of separation but they gonna high point the ball and they they usually have the better hands. Now, granted, T.O. didn't have the strongest of hands. He dropped a lot of passes. Yeah. Um, you know, but I brought that up to say, like, effort-wise, if Randy was one of those Larry Fitzgerald-type work ethic guys, he's probably the greatest football player to ever live. Damn, that, that nigga was a dog. and we You saw that <laughs> from his rookie season, like, like against those Cowboys. It was up because because he had a, he had a vendetta against us. We should have drafted him. And he, that's what he said. He said, "I'm a, every time I play y'all, which he did, I'm gonna put hands on y'all, which he did." And 
I say that with Shaq, Kobe said the same thing about Shaq. Like, if Shaq cared and had Kobe's work ethic, easily oh, the yeah. greatest player of all time. Because Shaq, early man. Shaq was bringing, bringing the ball up the court, had handles, Facts. step he back J's, all that stuff. He didn't work on he his could, he didn't work on his free throws, nothing. He couldn't be the, t- the kitchen table. <laughs> man. You know what I'm saying? So that's that a good that's a good talk, man. We got so we got Madden here. We just crowned a new champion. Let me go ahead and uh Parody, man. Flip the script here. New champion has been crowned. You see him there. Roger brought Jack home. Disney. <laughs> it's it's, all, it's your it's your fault. So you know, don't don't try to claim Fact, Disney on nobody. Nobody, te- nobody told you to sign uh Hurts to that contract. Or, or trying to or, hold on or, to all those players. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, shout out to Roger winning his first championship of the season. Yeah, it's my fault because I've implemented that 53 man roster. That's what's killing y'all too. <laughs> Having to keep 53. Facts. I threw four interceptions against that guy. I lost by what, 11? That's I'm crazy. so pissed. But anyway, that's what I do. I, I lose games. I, I, I should have won my playoff game. Fucking post route, drop post route. Oh, that was crazy. That, that, that was that, that was a dime too. That was a dime, man. Bro. I was like, I'm watching the game. Like, did he just really drop that? Great drop. Yeah, that was crazy. One interception. One interception. In Crush it. The yeah, the crucial, the most crucial time. It was a real, real good playoffs. I, I, I watched them just yeah. about every playoff game, and all the games were good. Um, so shout out to the league, man, for for great playoffs. Congrats to to Roger winning his first uh, yeah. first Super Bowl. So that's three users with their first Super Bowls in leather helmets this cycle. Um, like you said, man, shout out to Parody. I I did not expect. Uh, I didn't like that thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's not. not that. That's the wrong parody, man. Drex. <laughs> Yeah, Dr- the- yeah. Uh, 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 Vel got Vel got got manhandled, man. That yeah. was crazy. So Jake Jacob with a little run this past playoffs, man. He he, he good for he good for one a cycle. And he got those tall receivers with speed, man. man I, yo, it was crazy because like I'm like yo, I beat the bullshit out of out of, out of Jacob, and that, that was the last game he lost <laughs> up until the to the to the title game. Yeah, that was crazy. So uh, let's go here, man. Oh, so <laughs> talking about the the, 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 the playbooks, <laughs> but here we go. Here we go, man. NCAA is getting closer and closer, man. Before we, this, this has been this has been a good show anyway. Um, before we get up out of here, man, I had some ideas, and I've been thinking about without without more information on um, without more information on. The game is kind of hard to prepare for how we're going to implement our, our NCAA College Football League. And I, what I want to do is I'm going to make a server within a server. That's that's probably the first thing. Should I do a server within a server or its own separate server? Because I don't want to crowd up the server. Yeah. I feel like it's going to be a lot of different channels for how yeah. big. If, if, I'm, I hope it's 64 teams. Hopefully. I doubt it's that much. That's going to be crazy. You know what I mean? So let, 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 let's, uh, let's, let's, let's mock this up as if it's 64 uh, teams. And I'm down with that Drew naming our college football league Kings of the Gridiron. That would, that would mean bring it back and having, having that be our college football league. That'd be dope. Um, we still got that. We still got that nice logo we paid for, so we 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 can knock the dust off that joint. And um, so let's let, let's say so. Here we are. We got sixty four users. One of the things that I wanted to do was have a conference commissioner for every single conference. But with that saying, like every conference has to have a representative. So from ACC on down, we got to have somebody representing a specific conference. And a conference commission, you're responsible for scheduling, making sure people get scheduled. You're handling all your own sanctions. Now, obviously, you can you 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 can you can link up with uh, 
other commissioners and, you know, hey, I got this, this is going on. What do you think about this? Blah, 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 blah. But having a conference commissioner and, like, all the scheduling and stuff, and then we'll have a channel dedicated for each conference. Yeah. And then within that yeah. channel. Go ahead. Definitely, definitely a different uh, Discord back. Cause it's just a lot already, right? It's a lot, like yeah. you know what I mean. Like, and then if you have it just in the leather helmets joint, like that shit can't be like you have to scroll, like so. Yeah, yeah, definitely a different Discord for that shit, in my opinion. But that shit sounds dope as hell, though. Yeah. So, and then with the conference commissioner, like that person, you like have have your have your conference chats only visible to the people that are in that conference. You know what I'm saying? To kind of give it its own little vibe. Now, scheduling can take place outside of that conference, obviously. Like, if you play somewhere outside of conference, you can just DM or we have a scheduling chat that everybody can see. Yeah. Um, and then we'll post the schedules and stuff in there like that. 72-hour um, events. Yeah, I mean, that, so... Especially because it's, it's a lot more games. So we're, yeah. moving, we're giving that extra day. And then when we're playing Madden with the 48-hour events, there's really no cross-contamination. You know what I mean? Because we all, we all got lives. We all got lives and stuff like that outside of the game. Um, but, yeah. Uh, yeah. Top 25 clash game of the weeks. So, anytime it's a top 25 matchup, automatically game of the week. We'll pick the best game, obviously. Um, I can call it. You can call it. Scream. Yeah. Um, and then the rivalry week games, you know, something can be on the line, whether it be points, whether it be, um, you know, something we, we, we purchased or something that can be shipped back and forth between the rivals or whatever. Um, that was one of the things that, that I, I, I wanted to do. If you could expect, if you could, would you expand the playoffs? If it's a possibility, but I think 12 teams is already a lot. Uh, I think it's still a good. Good that's amount. a good amount. That's more than what, that's more than what we get in uh, NFL. Was fourteen in NFL with the new with the new, yeah. So yeah, I mean, worst case we'll do the same thing as the NFL do fourteen, um. But also the I found a national championship trophy, and it's cheaper than what we pay for the belts. So anytime somebody wins a national championship, we send you a trophy. The actual national championship trophy, yeah, the replica. So that's gonna be that's gonna be fire. Um, what do you think of some of those things, man? Nah, that shit sound dope as hell. Um, and the only thing, uh, only only issue I would see is like the biggest difference in the overalls of the teams and shit. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like, you get a randomized say you fucking pick sixty four. <laughs> And you picking Akron or some shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, that should be crazy. I feel like with that, like, we'll lose, like, a lot of users. Like, for those who ain't getting no type, uh, type team. I honestly... That's why I asked you earlier, like, how many uh, conferences were we doing? See, I honestly think that w because it's college, I don't think the overall of the team will matter. A lot of people pick their teams based off the jerseys when you play in college football. And the best part of the game is the build. So you may start off with that one-star school, you know what I'm saying? But we plan on playing for the entire cycle. So your one-star can be a five-star by the end of the end of the jaw. Plus, um, Leather Helmets get first dibs on all the, all the teams. So if it's 64, the first 32 picks are going to the Leather Helmets people. So, you know what I mean? Uh, I knew, I knew, I knew, uh, I spoke to, um, uh, Quasi. He got a bunch of PlayStation guys. Trub has PlayStation guys. So we'll be bringing over, um, we'll be bringing over some PlayStation people because it will be cross, cross, uh, cross platform action. So yeah. I think we can get the 64 easy. Plus, I'm, plus I, 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 I know other, I know other reputable Madden leagues that are looking for, you know, users and stuff like that to combine with. So. You know, worst case scenario, man, um, I'll take a lesser team because I know Kansas State probably going to top five. So, <laughs> where you know, I I I I I I I I take a lesser team if I have to. I will take an Alabama Kansas or something. State going in the top what? 
You know what I'm saying? Because I know, I know I might lose my team early. Alabama might be sitting there for me. So I just. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have any ideas or, or any any anything that you think you want to implement for the uh, for the college football? I don't know, man. I just I really hate that I haven't really put out anything yet. You know what I'm saying? As far as like what the game plan, the gameplay gonna be like, like shit like that because then you can like build off ideas on that without like you, yeah, you, have nothing. you know what I'm yeah you, it's, we, we, just, we really just we just know the game covered out like you know what i mean and, I, and, and everything everything that i've been thinking about thinking about i've been basing it off of 14, 14 like custom yeah. schedules and you know yeah. not having any cupcakes on your schedule and like making sure all your games are user games versus like like that's literally what what the conference commission will be responsible for like you gotta go in there and edit these schedules to make sure everybody is playing a user every single week. Ain't no ain't mm-hmm. no CPU cupcake uh one double A what's it one double A Southern or something like that where you're putting up a hundred points padding your stats. Um yeah, so that, that that's one of the things that, like the conference commission is probably gonna be the most important role. Are are you um allowing users to create a player? <laughs> Even though it goes into the broad junk and everybody can recruit. I player, mean, like, I think I think you, if you recruit somebody and you change their name, that's probably the extent of the creative player aspect that I think okay. we, should, we should probably go with. Because that's what I would do. I would recruit a guy, change their name to whatever I want them to be, depending on the college that I got. So kind of the same thing we do with Maddie. Um, as far as I, I saw, I saw um, a uh, Google, you know, you know, on Google, when you open it on your phone, it has all those like headlines and stuff like that based off how, what, yeah. what, it, what is listening to you say. Um, it, excuse me. One of the things it was saying was uh, Madden and college football will be integrated uh, pieces, which we expected it to be. So exporting up the college uh, draft class is going to be big. And I'm hoping that that can be the, instead of having to do our draft strength, calculator we can just keep implementing yeah. exporting our our college football draft classes so that'll be fun but that's all i got man i'm excited for the game i think i think there there's a lot of hype behind this thing that uh we're all looking forward to so just some of the things that i that, that, that i thought about if you guys have any ideas or any suggestions you know the suggestion box is there as far as ncaa um so, oh, I got one question. Go ahead. What, will it be team specific? Mm, that's something that we're going to have to think about. I don't even know how the game going to play. <laughs> you know, because if you got that army playbook, God for God. God. <laughs> triple option. Triple <laughs> option all game. Georgia <laughs> Tech playbook. Wing T out there. Facts. Um, yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know if I want to torture people that bad. You know what I'm saying? Like, good lord, um, that would be that that would be bad. But yeah, use the suggestion box for Madden and NCAA as we get closer and closer to our our new cycle, um, because a lot of a lot of good stuff happened this year and some things that we can tweak. You know, every year every year we look to get better, and uh, you know, I guess that's my part in shot, man. Continue to help us improve the league. I appreciate the attendance tonight. The chat was live. Um, I appreciate that. I'm going to get this loaded up. As soon as it uh, imports into uh, Twitch, I'm loading it right up to YouTube. Cause I'd rather, if you're going to rewatch it, watch it over on YouTube, get our numbers up over there because our numbers are ass yeah. over there. So, But I don't be loading them up right away because I'm, I'm trash like that. But I got my computer up. I'm working on some graphics. So I'll be able to uh, load it up tonight. So shout out to you guys for the activity. Shout out to the support. AC always. Shout out to you, man, uh, helping out yeah. with this thing. So uh, what part of shots sure. you got for me? Oh man, the only parting shots I got, man. Hey, um, keep being active, you know. Um, gonna replace a few guys, you know. A few more coming. A few more coming. Hey, yo. Hey, yo, that was crazy. Hey, that's the first one. God. Hey, yo. First one of the <laughs> night, man. <laughs> hey, you know, um, that's all I really got, man. Stay, continue to stay active, man. We gave a, a, a lot of, um, Vet users are giving up a lot of the forced wins, man, last season. So that's a fact. to stay active, man. Finish this thing off strong. All right, man. With that, man, 
We are going to get out of here. And, I, you know, I usually take us out with our, uh, you know, yeah, our I'm highlight. You know what I'm saying? So this is how we taking you out of here. Certified boogie man. I'm the one that up to score with him. Walk him down whole time. I know he got some hoe in him. Pull on him. Extort shit. Bully the flow on him. Say, Drake, I hear you like I'm young. You better not ever go to cell block one. To any bitch that talk to him and they in love, just make sure you hide your little sister from him. They tell me Chubb's the only one that get your hand-me-downs And party at the party playing with his nose now And Baca got a weird case, why is he around? Certified lover boy, certified pedophiles Wop, 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 dot, fuck him up Wop, 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 I'ma, I'ma do, do my stuff. stuff Why you trolling like a bitch, ain't you tired? Trying to strike a chord, and it's probably a minor